New tonight, housing affordability still remains a top concern for many home buyers across the country. Here in the Rocket City, officials are looking to provide more affordable, accessible, and additional housing options for people. News 19's Lindsay Smith joins us in the studio with more on the effort. Lindsay. Greg and Christine, with Huntsville being rated one of the top places to live in the country, more and more people are moving to the city every day. City officials say they hear you when people say housing is hard to come by and they're working to do something about it. As Huntsville continues to grow, more apartments, single family housing and affordable homes across the economic spectrum are needed. We're trying to make sure that we have appropriately developed uh, apartments and single family housing available uh, and that just takes time to do but most importantly we are planning for that at the latest city council meeting the 2024 fiscal year budget was amended to increase the strength of its community development department with a new full-time position an effort spearheaded by councilman Devin Keith I think we need to put together a comprehensive plan that can be led by a person an individual not um, just a number of ideas. The community development department manager has to come up with a plan to address the issues surrounding affordable, accessible, and homeless housing within city limits. That plan will be presented to the city council in June 2024, so any resulting programming will be considered in the city's 2025 budget. There's a lot of pieces in this puzzle, and now we're looking for someone that can bring all those pieces together uh, and we'll bring to city council uh, a working plan with some goals and initiatives that we want to go for the next you know, probably one, three, and five years. Huntsville's community development manager, Scott Irwin, tells me they're already working on the job description. Once the job description is developed, it's appropriately graded by the Human Resources Department. You know, hopefully by the end of the year, we'll be close to being having a job description available to advertise. Irwin says they're planning to look locally at candidates who know the market, but they'll also look for someone outside the area as well. He hopes to have someone hired in the first quarter of 2024. Greg.